So my truck is called the Beastie. So during the races, this is my official vehicle uh, with which I uh, marshal the races, keep an eye on the racers. I got this a couple of years back and I've sort of got all the history of uh, what the cycling events that I've been involved in, in India, internationally, associations, and I'm going to talk about all of them separately. Pune Randonneurs was the first club that I founded, uh, and it's the oldest uh, uh, randonneuring club in India, founded in 2010. And this one was the Pune Randonneurs was the club that started all the long distance 400, 600 uh, breves. I started to be the representative for uh, Audax India Randonneurs. Uh, I'm the representative to Arax Club Parisian and Le Randonneur Mondio. My own cycling uh, is done under the logo of Team Tate. Deccan Cliffhanger and Ultra Spice are also under the Ultra Marathon Cycling Association, which is a record keeping organization for ultra distances. The Simon Cycling Company, run by Aniket Mahashabde. Then the Pune Bicycle Championship was a race that we conducted, such a lovely race that we conducted in uh, Pune. Uh, from just 10, 12 kilometers, uh, but all uphill, Lavasa, Sihagar, I think a lot of people watching this film will remember that race because Pune had such a beautiful uh, racing community going on then. And these races were under the life cycle banner. And over here, I have the Ultra Spice race, uh, which goes from this place, Bogmalo, all the way through all the spice plantations, coffee, tea, um, pepper, you can see them, they're gorgeous plantations and of course it also goes through the forest which have uh, elephants in them. So that's how we developed the logo with the crank, the coffee beans um, and the ultra spice with the little flames and things going on. So the Deccan Cliffhanger race uh, started in 2014 by me as an ultra race. I've crewed twice at the race around Austria. This year I crewed for uh, Bharat who won the Ultra Spice 1000K and um, Darshan who crewed for him at the Ultra Spice. Then we have here the race across the West, which is, uh, which is a, a part of the race, uh, acro uh, race across America, a part of Ram, which ends at uh, Durango in Colorado. And it's one of the, it's the toughest segment of race acro uh, across America that is there. That's the same, their logo over here as well. And then these are stickers of uh, Race Across America. 3,000 refers to the miles. 3,000 miles is the Race Across America. I am very definitely the girl your mother warned you about. <laughs> so in addition to Inspire India's own races, I've also been race director at other lovely races in uh, India. One is the Thar Aravali uh, Adrenaline Rush and the Desert 500. You has done Ram qualifier segments twice. I was a race director in one edition. Backpack Outdoors is an outdoor trekking company run by Mayur Kivsara that runs, uh, that does all the marshalling of my road. He's been doing it with, for me for, from the very first edition. And MNC events is uh, run by Abhishek uh, Kolu as he's known. Uh, Kolu has been doing the Deccan Cliffhanger back-end logistic management since the last edition and he's been doing it very well. So Inspire India uh, is the company I founded uh, about three, four years back uh, under which I do all the cycle races that I create. And uh, the Race Across America. I've uh, crewed at the Race Across America for and the Race Across the West about five times I think and uh, officiated with the Race Across America as well. A lot of men have trucks and generally their trucks have this very masculine sort of energy going on. They're done in a very masculine way. But uh, when I bought her, I was very clear that for me, uh, she had a female energy. I refer to some aspects of my nature as the beast. So my truck is a reflection of some of that. And so she got named the beastie. <laughs>